What's going on everyone? It's your boy Top Cat the Gamer and we are back with some more Trails Through Daybreak the demo. <laughs> Can't wait to play the game, but yeah, demo right now. Alright, but we are on to uh this is a third part of this demo. Uh but we're gonna uh we just got to be seeing what happened with uh Giacomo and found out a couple things about Van and what's going on. So now we're going to dive in a little bit more. I'm pretty sure, like I said in the last video, that they're going to probably just let you play the whole entire prologue. That's what it seemed like it's going through here. But um, yeah, we're going to go ahead and get right back into it. I hope y'all are having a very blessed day. Let's get it going. Oh, we got the answer, right? We are now arriving at the cathedral. The doors on the left side will open. I mean, I don't blame him for making her get off, but... I thought I told you to get off at the next stop. You'll have to forgive me for being selfish. But you have to understand just how much that memento means to me. Damn, I thought she walked off the thing. What am it's I tripping something off that of? connects me, <laughs> not just to my great-grandfather, but my mother and grandmother, too. And that's not the only reason I want to see this through now. A man is dead. I know you don't like the idea, but... But I feel like I have to be a part of this. Whatever may come to happen. I'll do everything I can to ensure my own safety. And I'll do everything you ask in the field. So please... <clears throat> won't you let me come with you? <sighs> Fine. You're the client. I can see you at least know your way around that staff and arts. <sighs> but you're gonna have to do everything to keep yourself safe. And if I give you an order, you follow it. If you fail to do that, I terminate our contract then and there. We clear? I do like the bit of, um... Like, more of a darker tone we have here. Everything in, you know, the other games always seemed so lighthearted. It had its moments where things got dark, but this immediately started off more dark than the other games have. Like, you already got somebody it's, it's super murdered. And it's like, well, damn. And it was actually blood everywhere when it happened. And it was like, you know, just like letting you know that this is, this is going to be a different type of series here than the other Trails games. Absolutely. Thank you. Let's see where we head to now. We are now arriving at Edith Central Station. Those transferring to the Transcontinental Railroad. Some pretty good music on here too. Very mellow stuff, I like it. Feels like the sun went down real fast. But even at this hour, with nothing going on, there's so many people. It is how most of the people arrive in the city after all. Not to mention all the department stores. There's also that fancy new Orville store that doubles as cafe that's been drawing a lot of customers. Yeah, I know the one. Funny to think how much this area has changed in the last couple, I mean, just a couple of years. Those big screens weren't there, weren't here before either. But now it's hard to imagine them not being here. See, this changes so fast it makes your head spin. True, it is. A uh, very good evening to you, Edith. It is now 6.45 p.m., which means it's time for today's evening news. Okay. President Graham Hart held a press briefing at the presidential building in Vontai at 3 p.m. today. So, see what I'm saying how that says, it looks like it says Vontail, but he just said Vontai. 
Like, what the fuck? <laughs> he discussed this year's ending of the reparations from Erebonia, and with it, the impact it will have on Calvert's future. It has been two years since the Erebonian Empire launched an unprovoked war of aggression against us. A vile act we were generous enough to forgive. The price it paid in the form of reparations was steep, but every last mirror was, in my strong opinion, justified. I believe its actions, its atrocities, the past several centuries are behind it. I warmly welcome it back to the international community with open arms, promoting an era of peace between us, even when it comes to Crossbell State. With reparations due to come to an end this year, some have raised concerns that an economic recession is on the horizon. Those fears are unfounded. We have used these past two years to transform our economy to bolster our capital, to better our technology. No nation has surpassed what we have accomplished because no nation can. We cannot take our supremacy for granted. I have every intention of taking this power and using it to lead our great world as a whole to a more glorious, prosperous future. Well, if it isn't everyone's favorite president, he's a little heavy-handed, but you can't say he hasn't delivered. Cavus GPD passed the empires in his first year in office, and this year is on track to surpass that by a lot. <laughs> yes, I suppose that's true. He's been enacting some very dangerous policies across the board, and not just economically. Compared to the last guy, yeah. Samuel Rocksmith seemed more grounded. Anyway, didn't mean to talk politics. Would you prefer not to waste time in the uh, rival territory? You have a rival? Ah, uh, the Bracer Guild. Oh, the Bracer Guild. I do remember hearing they had a branch near the Central Station. Yep. Maybe they aren't expecting to hear anything close to home. They're still... They still got a sharp crew on board. So let's get to work. You gotta get what uh, you're looking for before the duo who got uh, Giacomo do. Right. Do you know where the entrance to his base is then? Right over there. Down the alley. The alley next to the old department store leads to the door we're looking for. Come on. Yes, sir. Yeah, alrighty. Let's see Oops. if we... Nope, they won't let us do it. Damn it. They won't let us do jack shit. Can we go up? Okay, we can go up here. I can't stop staring at Trion Tower. It's so pretty. That it back there? It's also big as hell. 230 arch tall, to be exact. Can't miss it wherever you Whoops. go. Well, let's... When tourists uh, come to visit, it's always the first thing they see. Yeah, they will not let not us go. Way. Yep, we're locked in. This is it? Yeah, this one doesn't lead to the subway. But you can still jimmy it the same way. Was Giacomo the one who altered the locks like this? Not him. It's just been a thing us shady folks have known about for a while. There are places like this all over the city. People make a good use of. CID knows about them too. Uh, they just leave it alone. They do? Why? I'm sorry. I keep egging conversation on when we really need to move. I'm ready for whatever we find there. Good, because there's no turning back now. All right, Lego.
Hmm? Is something wrong? Nah, we can go in. Is that just my imagination? Eh, uh, I don't pick up a scent. So I guess it doesn't matter either way. What is Wolverine? That is Ren. His nose is as sharp as ever. That's Ren. I, I, I that's gotta be Ren. Adios knows how this is going to end. But it better be with my classmates safe, Spriggan. So, I, I think on here now she's about... I want to say 17 or 18. I think, uh, I think on... I think Because I think on Reverie she was... Uh, 16, I think they said. But uh, it's going to be so good to see how far she's come. If you know her story, is a pretty tragic one. But she is like, has so much character growth. I don't think she's a party member in this game, though. I think like she's one of those people that like comes in for a little bit, if I'm not mistaken. But I don't think she's a regular. I don't know if she ends up becoming a regular in the other games, but. I don't think she's a regular party member, though. Is this place a relic from the Middle Ages? Might go back to the Dark Ages, even. Edith might not have a leg up on the old capital's history, but it still goes back to the Middle Ages, easy enough. Back on all the subways and waterways we've been building, and the underground's a sprawling mess and a half now. I see. I suppose it does make sense that a place like this would exist here, when you think about it, though. Hmm? What? Crap. Man, is that a... a monster? Well, a spirit, more like. Never seen them in the capital. What the hell's up with this? The higher elements at work? So you don't want to turn back and wait outside the station? The cafe be a good spot to... No, I'm fine. I have a feeling my staffs and arts will be highly effective against foes like this. So if anything, I'm relieved I came with you instead of staying behind. <laughs> Got me good. Then let's do this. I'll back you up, so feel free to uh, go hog wild. Then I will. Alright, let me give you these just in case. Okay. These are Zifa quartz, aren't they? Yeah, insert them in your Zifa slots, and they'll be um uh, and let the ah they'll let you use different shards. Give it a shot. You'll pick it up faster than me explaining it. Then I will. All uh, right, you can set uh, quartz from the quartz tab and menu. So let's see. The effects of a set quartz raise a character stats. So you can auto equip too. Okay. By setting quartz in the open slots, you can manifest all sorts of hard uh, shard skills. Each line has different shard skills. The overall attribute value for the line changes with the set quartz. And when you reach a certain number of attribute points, new shard skills manifest. It's worth noting that quartz set into the attribute lock slots are worth double their value in points. Hmm. Okay. So we'll go with um switching to start her first. <clears throat> I think she's supposed to have new shard skill added. Or should I give him a uh, New shard skill added. Just freeze. Yeah, I definitely have got to get used to this. Shifting to maintenance mode. I feel like he should have evade.
Hmm. Eh. Switching to maintenance mode. We'll put it on her. Shard skills updated. All right, we'll get the boogie used to it. I just really check this out. Now we're ready to move on. Yeah, let's get. Wait, this feels like the higher elements are active. Yeah, what the hell? What do you mean? I'm sure. You, I'm sure you could tell uh, this just from uh, just ah. I'm sure you could tell this part just from the fights we've had so far. Monsters are usually only weak to the four basic elements. Fire, water, earth, and wind. But every once in a while, you find a place where they can be weak or resistant to the higher elements. of time, space, and mirage. You're saying that this is one such place? Pretty sure it is, yeah. Either way, we'll soon find out. Let's keep moving. Alright, check in these weakness, if you're targeting info. Okay. Shard skills. I'm trying to see something here. Okay. Um, yeah, I don't think we need to risk. Let's go ahead and save, though. All right. Interesting. Here we go. Ah, they stuck up on us. There are an awful lot of them too. They sure are. But it's times like these that uh, these shards really shine. Time to teach you how to use the S S C L M. What the fuck? What are those? You'll see. I'll give you the rundown while we fight. <laughs> it's a lot of shit. Okay. The SL, uh, I mean, the SCLMs are activated upon making contact with a party member. Take advantage of the Zephyr shard system. By overlapping Zephyr uses shard tools, you can activate high. Oh, okay, so basically, uh, like a um, uh, the follow-up attack or like the, like a combo attack. Attack while the SCLM is active for your partner to uh, perform a follow-up attack. Certain shard skills will activate more frequently if the SCLN remains active after the attack. Okay. Whatever the fuck that's supposed to mean. Um, if you activate craft or art on the SCLN, I'm gonna have to think of something short to say for that shit. The Schlem. <laughs> if it's active, your partner's power will increase. Huh. It's working. How fucking away. Take that. Take this. <laughs> the hate went up. <laughs> uh let's see. I kind of see. I kind of see it now. I kind of see. Initializing it. drive. <laughs> All you want, yes. Okay.
Oh, okay, there's the follow up. There we go. Okay. I did it. Okay, 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 okay. We're getting there. Good job. You kept up pretty well. So that's the power of the slim. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna call it that too. I've never been able to understand how someone else is going to act so clearly before. Yeah, it's a lot like the combat link system used by. That's why I wanted to say damn link. By Airbonia's fifth generation Arcus battle world. Arcus units never saw much use outside of the Empire, though. Still, combat links were mainly designed to be used by two man teams. Where Slim is a a system where it's a lot easier to switch around partners. It makes it a force to be reckoned with when used by large groups. Shards really are amazing, aren't they? I never imagined you could use them for so much. Yeah, I'm not an expert on them uh, either, mind you. Still got a lot to learn myself. But even I can tell that the Zifa standard has a whole lot of potential. Looks like you were right about the oral staff of yours working well against spirits, too. Yes, I'm glad that proved true. The more we do it, the more confident I am in my ability to fight. I suspect we're going to need to make more use of the slims the farther we advance through here. So I think it would be prudent for me to be a little closer to the front line. What do you think? I'm fine with a little. I still don't want you going out in front of me, though. I can accept that. All right. Okay. Well, I think we're all right for right now. Um, yeah, I am going to go ahead and use a cheap heal here. That hits the spot. All right. Okay. Damn, I should have did the other thing. All right, attack bonus. Yeah, we got the um. Oh, okay, he got zero EP. I was like, damn, how come he's not taking off anything? Down. It's stunned, okay. Uh... Certain arts will be more effective. Go ah, okay. Get it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, this battle system is pretty fun. It's gonna take some getting used to, but I'm digging it so far. Um, it's a chest over here, but that damn thing looks strong. Oh shit. Damn, how far does it chase us? Where the hell did it go? That was weird. Oh fuck it. All right. Um. Attack their weakness with an arc. Keep it up. It's working. Attack oh, he keep he, he keep having a zero arc thing. 
Yeah, start using that to my advantage. All you on, yes. Uh, nah, that's too much. That's too much EP for that. Definitely gonna be added to her. Shit, everything's been for her, honestly. Let's see. Yeah, her ATS is uh 46. Well, I guess I better put it on him, huh? Cause uh he's using some um arts too. I need everybody to be. I'm, I want everybody to be about even at least right now. Okay. Going down. Oh, we in one piece. Arts work best on this enemy. Take this. Let's see that. Deploying strong. Caution. Uh. Keep it up. It's working. Cipher activate. Oh yeah, she got a zero on me. Yeah. All you on yet? We're down. Eat this. Ben. Here goes. Nice. Ben. Sucker. A chance. <laughs> no. Nice. Okay. Starting to get used to it. Starting to get there. There's got to be some kind of something out of it. But nothing's jumping out at me. Wait, what the hell is over there? Looks like he's deep in thought. I better leave him alone. Now, oh. where could that trigger be? Wait, hmm. is it? I'm like, what the hell? They both saying it. The same shit I'm thinking, but... Let's see. Okay, it looked a lot different from this way. It wrong. Hmm. Hard to say, honestly. I feel like I'm missing something. Saying something about a trigger. I don't know if I'm just walking right past something. No. Nothing over here.
I, I guess we just move forward. I don't know. It's got me wondering though. I don't know. I thought maybe there was like a breakable wall or some shit like that, but yes, not. I couldn't even get through the door uh, quick enough. Uh, shit. I'm really gonna have much of a choice right now. Certain arts will be more effective. Damn thing in his heart. All you on yet. Here goes. I'll fight you up. Really? All you on yet. Sucker. Like hell you are. You'll pay for that. Mm. Well. Keep it up. It's working. Activating hey. drugs. The chance. Grab the light. White needle. I owe you one. Ben. Uh. Okay, wow, then another move come out of nowhere. Here goes. Um Keep it up, it's working. Over here. All for you. All you on yet. Have some more. <laughs> Bring it on! Activating drive! Activating drive! Here goes! They're down! In fact, we wasted you way too many EP, too much EP right there. Yeah, see? Huh? It is like a brick wall. How about that? <laughs> Called it. Um. Wait a minute. Hmm. Switching to maintenance mode. Let's see, there are even more monsters this time. Yeah, but I might have an idea how to take care of them. How's my boost gauge, Mayor? Boost gauge fully replenished. Good stuff. What was that about? I'll show you. Time for your second lesson. Use your shards. So Alright. Activate a shard boost. We're pressing L1. Different effects from holo cores are activated. And shard skills trigger more often. What the hell? There's <laughs> a lot of shit to remember. Okay. Alright. It's maintained for two turns. Gain an extra S boost. Okay. You know, I ain't even thought about um, S crafts on here. Wait. Doing this right? Go all out. Oh, you, okay. Tap it. Got a whole slew of 
Like hell you are! He does it automatically, or is... I don't know if you have to... What you have to do to activate that, or what? Oh, a chain, okay. Maybe that's like uh, one of those uh, link attacks. This'll hurt. And would miss him. Like hell you are. I'll take you on. Activating try. Searching arts will be more effective. Pull out all the stops. Eat this. That's how it goes. Okay. That wraps that up. Espoo seem like they'll be very useful when the time is right. They are. Though they ain't really the kind of thing you have to save. Are you ain't really the kind of thing you have to save for just the right time. I would say that's them letting us know. You don't have to time that shit. Cause you be trying to say your S crafts for everything, but interesting. So are they getting rid of S crafts or, you know, love the S crafts on here. Um, well, in the series, just use them when you can. That's all there is to it. Well, isn't that convenient? I'll keep that in mind. So don't really have to save that up. All right. Stack bases, boxes. Yep, 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 yep. CP, okay. Oh, they get back CP now, okay. It's good. Oh, shit. Um, you know what? Have some more. Should be safe for now. Let's get to work. Time for you to focus. Um. Cancer step? What the hell? Okay. <laughs> the fuck? Switching to maintenance mode. All right. So, how do I get this other treasure? Another breakable wall over here somewhere? Okay. Good work, guys. We all in one piece.
Uh, well, there's one down here too. Let's go here first. What a massive foe. And the bigger they are, the harder they tend to hit. Try not to get too close. The best fighting from a distance. About deadly strikes, okay? Every so often, certain enemies will use powerful attacks called deadly strikes. These attacks cannot be avoided, and if you are hit by one, you will be forced into battle at a disadvantage. It's best to either keep your distance and remain vigilant for these attacks, or to put them on your own shards first. Okay, bear in mind that enemies with low HP tend to use deadly strikes more frequently. Once you've landed enough attacks on an enemy, it may be it may ready a deadly strike. If you want to receive an in, okay, can be dodged, so be sure to distance yourself and deploy shards for the enemy can hit you. Okay. Watch out! That enemy looks strong. Cypher activate! <laughs> I'll take you on! Initializing drive. <laughs> Got your number! Nice. All you on yet? Here goes. There we go. Um, have some more. Then, full boost. Go all out. Give them your all. I'll dice you up. All you on yet. They're stunned. Have some more. Nice. All right. I think we. I, I think I have a better handle on him now. You did good, but no letting your guard down because of it. Right, of course. Really, uh, it really was a hell of a performance, especially since this is likely her first day fighting for real. No way she hasn't raised. Uh, she wasn't raised with a silver spoon in her mouth, but she's braver than most would give her credit for. Throw in the weird, weird orbman she's after, and I got questions. Just who is this girl? By the way, what's up? <laughs> I've been bracing myself well against, uh, well enough against these monsters and spirits so far. But do you think you could also tell me a little more about A, since we might be going up against them? Guess I should, huh? Ordinarily, people are better off not knowing the damn thing. But if they're after your great grandfather's memento, then I guess there's no getting around it. That's what I was thinking too. First, A is just a code name. It's short for Armada. They're mafia that go way back in, here in, Cal in Calvert. I don't like the sound of that already. I wonder if um, that's something that uh, Lee was a part of, like the Heyue. Still, they were weren't that big of a group back then. We're not talking about a big Eastern syndicate here. They were nothing. Until they weren't. Over the past few years, they've gotten much, much bigger. Now they're the talk of the criminal underworld. Wow. But their name never ends up in the paper, I assume. Yeah. Obvious why big papers like the Terrell Times won't cover them. But even gossip rags don't have the balls. It's an unspoken rule. Cross the line and you're done. I still don't know what the deal is with this memento you're after. But you really should have gone to the guild or the cops. This makes me believe the uh, the rookie reporter girl is going to end up like being the one that actually does say something about them. <coughs> you still could if you want it. But, well, not my job to force you to turn, uh, turn to them. Mine's to be there if you feel like you can't. The best outcome here is for us to get the goods before A can. 
and have the gills swoop in and take up the glory. I mean, take the glory. Two birds, one stone, three even. You make the gills sound like they're your cleanup crew. You really have no scruple, uh, no scruples, do you? <laughs> Mighty please, Dad. You think so? Now let's get a move on. Of course. Oh, come and think of it. Hmm. When you first refused my request for help, did you already suspect that the Mafia was involved in this? Uh, she really is a sharp one. I had a hunch, yeah. There's been something ominous about the air since last night. No, I think this difficulty is fine for right now. <laughs> it's just gonna be... Okay. It's gonna be alright. Uh, let's see here. Ah, okay. <coughs> okay. Oh, okay, so that's where we're supposed to be going. Alright, let's go back here and go get this other chest. Uh, yeah. I don't like the fact that it seems like you gotta lean a Switching lot more on arts on well. here. Um. To do the kind of damage you want. It, yeah. not, Van is not doing enough damage to me. I don't know. Maybe it's just. Let's get to work. Gotcha. Maybe I don't know. Maybe I, maybe I suck at the game or some shit right now. Good work, guys. We all in one piece. That looks like a nice chest. <laughs> this could get tricky with some men. Can't do that. Going all in. Certain arts will be more effective. Uh. Huh? Like hell you are. <laughs> there. All you want yet. <laughs> You'll pay for that. <laughs> Okay. Um. Hmm. Somebody gonna have to give up something here. Uh. Shifting let's see what it looks mode. like. Let's give it to him. Since he does have to do more attacks. Alright. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Is that what they were talking about the trigger? Hmm. Whoops, dead end. Let's turn back. Hold your horses, girl. We should look around a little more. Yeah, there we go. A 
hidden entrance? Huh, guys, nothing if not thorough. The side out should be dead ahead. Boy, they have uh so many ruins and shit built up under right um <laughs> Ooh, that hits the spot. Alright. Go ahead and save here. All right, and I'm going to end here, and when we come back, we will be heading on to part four. Yeah, I thought I would be able to get this in one go, but learning the battle system and trying to get through this is, yeah, I, it's going to take, it's take a little bit of time, but yeah, we're going to come back, and I think we should probably finish it up in the next one. I'm pretty sure the boss fight is going to be here and whatever else is going to lead up to the end of the demo. But thank you all for rocking with me. I appreciate well. everyone checking out the vids. As always, if you're new to the channel, tap that like button and subscribe if you have not. Liking really helps out the videos. I appreciate everybody lately who has been liking and checking out the vids. Come back for some more, and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.